For great deals on Ultimate Team Coins, check out FIFA Coins online. You're right guys, it's Capcom Tom here and I am back for part number three of our three part pack opening for this team of the week. We're going to be opening another 10 premium gold packs, trying to pull one of those incredible informs from this week. There is inform Kagawa, second inform Suarez and inform Chiellini, so really strong ones. If you missed the other episodes, the, the parts before, I'd definitely go and watch them. Some excellent pulls in there involving a Balotelli, um, Remy, a whole load of very good players. So hopefully you're going to continue on some of that luck from the first part. The second part was a little bit disappointing pointing but hopefully in this third part we're going to be pulling all the big players now let's jump straight into it with our first pack all going to be open with FIFA points don't know whether you guys think it makes difference opening with them with FIFA points or not do leave a comment if you think it does leave a comment if you don't so um yeah we're not going to be keeping very many consumables now because I really can't or don't have enough space in my club anymore to keep them. So we're just going to keep the very, very good stuff like the very rare contracts and uh, fitness cards as well as a few other things. Nothing really worth keeping in this pack. Uh, there is a Borussia Dortmund player there. Hang on a sec. Let's just check the formation of Hayam or Hayam. Uh, might keep him as well just because we can. And then we'll quick sell the rest. So... What we're looking for is one of the Team of the Week players to flash up. Yes, my controller's battery has once again fallen out. It got a bit, it, a bit over the top and just bashed it. And because I keep dropping it, the battery pack falls out. I may have to tape it in there to avoid all of this annoyance. Anyway, let's jump in, open this pack, see who we get. Who's it going to be? Pizcek. I love Pizcek, as you all know. Put him in my perfect defence squad builder a couple of weeks ago. Was the inform I was using then, but this one is also very good. I mean, the red normal card is almost as good as the inform most of the time. We also got Rafinha. Um, looks like half decent right back from the Pro League as well. So we'll keep those two players. So uh, getting ourselves an 80 rated player there, not a bad start. Redeem that 1,000 coin unlock. Keep that contract. Keep that fitness card. And then we can move on for the rest of this pack opening so um i don't know what you guys have got maybe you should put in the comment section who your best pull of uh, this team of the week is uh, don't put like ronaldo or something because i just don't believe you unless you got picks you can gtfo then uh let's have a look who's going to be zirkov yuri zirkov uh, not really a great player i think he's non-rare as well yep plays for a match <laughs> Um, pretty, uh, pretty hard to pronounce name as you can probably tell from my struggling. Oh, this guy, I've never, I've never looked at this guy before. I might start, I might use him once or twice. Uh, 72 pace centre back. Very decent amount of centre uh, pace for that guy there. What else we got? Uh, not worth hanging on to any of these. So we will quick sell them and move swiftly on to our next pack. Really want to get an 85 plus rated player. That would be unreal. Um, so far, our best is 84. I think we have a sold Dado and a Balotelli. Gallus this time, the slowest of the slow centre-backs. Bar per Mertesaska. No rare card or rare um, rare player this time. Did get a rare squad fitness, which are always worth hanging on to. They do go for a little bit of coinage. But we are running out of space in our consumables pretty quickly. Not worth keeping any of these, though. Got to quick sell this uh, rare silver contract as well because... As you can see, I've only got three spots in my consumables, 23 in my trade pod. Don't want to get into a situation where I have to discard something unbelievable just because we don't have enough space for it. Got, I think, six packs to open left and uh, really hoping for something decent. Malafiv, one of the better Russian goalkeepers. Um, not the best. Uh, I think that goes to Akinfiv, the best Russian goalkeeper. Um, he is 80 rated though, not going to keep him though, not worth it. A CM to Cam card, they're worthless. So the only thing we're going to keep in this whole pack is a fitness card. Oh, that is brutal. Only thing in a whole pack, fitness card. Not happy with that one. Really need to see a marked improvement from these packs now. We're rolling up to the very end of this pack opening. If we want to see a Ronaldo or something, we're going to have to get something. Dawson, oh my goodness, really, really, really really i'll keep him because he's 80 rated and he's british but other than that oh i can to cm thank you that's what we like to see that's 8k in the bag right there so definitely one that we'll be keeping on that front and then there's a few other things not worth keeping uh this fitness card i guess we've uh, made a habit of keeping all of these so far so we will keep that one but other than that we will quick sell the rest i could be really slow and long and just apply all the um contracts to my players as we go instead of discarding them but i'm not going to just because i don't think you guys really 
should be sitting around watching me uh, apply consumables to my players. Really not that enjoyable to watch. Who are we going to get? Slow load. Larson. Nope. Again, we're still not getting in amongst the good players. We've got Fernando. He's 80 rated. 71 placed. CDM. Half decent player there. We will keep him. Didn't realise there was such a... Oh, that's a good card. Centre forward to striker. I don't mind a piece of that. That's another 6k there. Thank you very much. We will keep that. Don't think we're going to keep any more fitness cards unless they're rare because otherwise we're going to run out of space in the trade pile. Only got 22 spots left in the trade pile and that has to fit all of our consumables in as well. So, three packs remaining. Come on EA, let's have it. Let's have it. Have at me. Come at me. Just give me something. Sahi, no. Not him. Not him. A rare silver guy. He has 76 pace. Not fantastic. We do get a rare squad morale card. They will go for about 800 coins. We also get a all attributes card. We will keep that as well. But I think we can actually keep these fitness cards. Looking at it, we've only got two packs left. I think that we've got plenty of space. So we'll quick sell the rest of that shite and move on to the final two packs. Please, EA. Please, just give me it. Give me it now. Give me it now. You're trolling me. To wait me to making me wait till the very last packs. Who's it going to be? Alex. Oh, man. If that had been a Thiago Silva, I would have freaked out. But it's his shit centre-back partner, Alex. Only 54 pace. That's why I say shit. Not because he is a shit player in real life. Before the trolls come at me and start freaking out because I called someone rubbish. I know how you guys love to do that. But there you go. Another pretty dire pack. That Alex will probably only go for about 900 coins. Really not worth the paper he's printed on i guess if he was a real power card but he's not he's a an electronic card so there you go maybe not worth the electricity it was used to generate him final card or final pack final pack final pack final pack let's do it let's do it let's just do it we're gonna have something it's gotta be good who's it gonna be i couldn't even read that name that name is ridiculous it's like like 100 letters long we got Pablo Hernandez. Oh, and it's that stupid Croat right back. That's it. I'm not having that. I'm opening one pack with coins. I'm opening a pack with coins. This is all how, always how it goes down. End up opening packs with coins. 4 2 3 1 player card. That's not too bad. But we are going to open one pack with coins. I actually send him to the trade pile. I reckon I can sell him on four a little bit because he's in a 4 4 2. But come on. I feel it. I feel it. This coin pack. This coin pack, it will undeniably prove that you shouldn't spend money on packs. You should just spend your coins. Come on. Who's it going to be? Who's it going to be? Soaping dingus. Damn it. So that is another team of the week hunt that has gone terribly badly. Didn't manage to pick out any in this part. There were some very good players in the previous parts, as I said. Balotelli being the biggest player that we pulled in this three-part pack opening. But other than that, we are looking at a pretty disappointing time. So, guys, if you have enjoyed the video, please drop it a like. That would be really appreciated. Uh, subscribe if you haven't already, because I do a pack opening every week. I think I'm going to continue to do this sort of pack opening uh, three-part series every week after Team of the Week. But other than that, I will stop talking. I will leave it there, and I will see you all next time.